Hi folks, this is Max from uh, High on Android.com, where we get high on Android every day. Anyway, today we're going to talk about uh, how to transfer large files, any type of files, uh, from your Android phone to the other Android phone or Android tablet, between any two Android devices. Now, there's a program called uh, Fast File Transfer um, that allows you to do this. Now, you can do this with Bluetooth also, but uh, speeds are very abysmal. Uh, near like 50 kilobytes per second at most and also even if you use um, the second method you can do is set up an FTP server on one of your phones and use the other one um, to transfer that one is sort of slow too uh, and you gotta set it up uh, there is this app called fast files transfer as you can see here um, that allows you to kind of turn your phone into a Wi-Fi temporary Wi-Fi hotspot and you can download it straight from the other a Wi-Fi so you get speeds uh, as if they were just connected via Wi-Fi well which they are um, so you can you can get pretty good speed so let's do this uh, pretty easy to do and uh, first what you'll need to do is go ahead and download a uh, fast file transfer now the developer of this app says that it's not supported on some phones like Droid Razor uh, most of the HTC phones um, but you can still try it anyways and also it might work if you have an AOSP ROM installed so if you have a custom ROM installed um, do try it type fast file transfer on your phone and go ahead and download fast file transfer and uh, pretty easy to do once you download it simply open uh, open let's open the uh, fast file transfer and also you'll, you'll need to set a password um, so I'm just gonna put uh, um, I love my oh you know what I'll just not put a password you don't have to put a password since I'm just gonna transfer a file real quick um, and it says uh, to send a file uh, you know find a file in your file browser send or share so I'm gonna go ahead and open my file browser if you don't have one you can download a ES file explorer uh, it seems like I don't have one so I'm gonna go ahead and download um, ES file explorer or your favorite file explorer it doesn't matter and uh, let's go find a big file I know I've got a bunch of ROMs on my file and sometimes I actually need to do this I you know one of my phones have my sim card and I don't have uh, Wi-Fi somewhere then I'll download onto one of my phones and transfer it to the other phone so let me go ahead and go list this uh, Big C Maguro I'm gonna go ahead and transfer this this is about 253 megabytes um, so using Bluetooth, this is going to take like 20-30 minutes, or if you, even if you use FTP, it's going to take you like 10-15 minutes, sucks. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, long press. There should be a menu for send or share. Uh, with ES File Explorer, you can share. And I'm going to go ahead and choose file, fast file transfer, and let it initialize here. And uh, show Wi-Fi on device and choose fast uh, file transfer alright so I'm gonna go ahead and go to my Wi-Fi here um, go to my Wi-Fi and uh, I'm gonna go s search for a uh, fast file transfer there um, you can also rename it to whatever you want alright so I'm gonna choose that and it's gonna actually connect to fast file transfer now if you set a password it'll say something else but there you go fast file transfer I'm connected uh, now I've just got to I just got to put my browser to that uh address there and uh, it will start downloading and that's pretty much it. So I'm going to go ahead and go to my browser and type 192.168.43.1 uh, uh and 8080. Exactly like what it says on here and this will download that file and you can see how fast it's going for 253 megabytes uh, we're gonna be done actually by the time um, you know we're finished talking now this isn't perfect it may not work for all of your phones uh, but the only way to find out is try it out and uh, um, it should work if you have an AOSP even if your uh, device isn't supported if you have a custom ROM um, you know that it, it should work 
and also should work on most TouchWiz ROMs. Uh, this, basically, this is the same thing as kind of a Wi-Fi Direct that the uh, S Beam uses. But you know, this way you see, I don't have a, a TouchWiz in, installed on none of my phones on these phones at least, and now I can transfer 250 megabytes uh, within like a minute or so. So this is a great way um, to ch to share your large files between uh, two different Android devices. That way you don't have to use a computer, um, you know, connect it back and forth. And it's almost done here. Um, so I hope this answers your questions. Uh, and uh, there you go, 100% sent. And boom shagalaka. I've got the whole uh, Bixi Maguro here. And you can see I've got, uh, oh, let's go actually look at it. Let's make sure I've got the whole whole um, file here make sure the size is the same um, just to prove you to that it's the same yeah there we go let's go look at the uh, my download folder it should download to your download folder and there we go there's my Bixi Maguro and let me go ahead and click on properties you can see both are 256 666 277 bytes I can't even check the sh uh, the MD5 and see that uh, I've successfully transferred a 253 megabyte file within about a minute or so uh, within you know this video and uh, yeah this MD5 sometimes takes long and my MD5 matches so boom shakalaka um, so that's the app of the month uh, fast file transfer now again it may work or may not work for all devices you just need to make it work on the device you're sending files from uh, um, you know if you're sending it to Droid Razor it'll be fine just you just gotta have it working on the device uh, you're sending it from anyway um, try it out and do let me know what you think of this app but I think you'll like it uh, and uh, now you can transfer big files between two Android phones and of course you can't do this on an iPhone um, so another reason to buy Android and uh, this should work on any most Android phones uh, gingerbread and up and uh, that's what the developer said um, so anyway thanks you guys for watching this video if this video has helped you learn uh, one more new thing about Android why it's better than you know iPhones don't forget to hit that like button for me here subscribe button down there and also this does not require root and uh, don't forget to share this with your friends on Twitter Facebook or Google Plus and I'll see you guys later. I'm still in Thailand. Uh, I'll be traveling to Bangkok. And uh, yeah, you know what? Um, I did go on an elephant ride the other day. Let me show you a little clip. Um, some of you may be wondering what I've been doing in Thailand. Um, so I've been getting high on elephants. And uh, see you guys later. Have a great week. And I'll see you guys soon. Yeah. Hello, you know it? Hello, Kap. Up now. <laughs> Up now, elephant up now. Hello, Dick. Hello, Dick. Hello, Dick. Hey, Dwayne Beanie. Say hi on Android. Hi on Android. Go hi on Android. <laughs> Go hi on Android. Okay. Oh, you on the elephant? Yeah. How do you like it? Oh yeah, it is. It's a thousand much like it. Uh-huh, thousand much like it.